If you got some problems, we'll be there to solve them. We're a squad who can do the job. We're a squad who can do the job. The monster is in trouble. We'll be there on the double. We're the squad who can do the job. We're the squad who can do the job. The monster mask squad. Terrific, horribly horrific Monster Mat Squad! Scary Face Picture Day! Two points! Four points! <laughs> Six points! Yeah! <laughs> Sorry, Max. The screen screen surprised me. Oh, that's okay, Goo. You scored! <laughs> And the scream screen always surprises Goo. The scream screen! Oh, somewhere in Monstrovia, there's a monster in need. And whenever a monster needs our care, the Monster Mask Squad will be there! It's Mrs. Mopley, the monster daycare teacher. Hi, Mrs. Mopley! Oh, thank goodness you're there, Monster Math Squad. It's Scary Face Picture Day. I love Scary Face Picture Day. It's the day that all the little monsters get their class picture taken wearing their favorite scary masks. Yes, but unfortunately, all the scary masks are mixed up. I don't know which mask fits which monster. Don't worry, Mrs. Mopley. We'll be right there to help. Oh, thank you, Monster Math Squad. See you soon. I'm sure we can figure out whose scary mask is whose by using Monster Math. Yeah! Monster Math can solve any problem. For sure! Because Monster Math is everywhere! Hey, will you join the Monster Math Squad on the job? Join the squad! Join the squad! You will? Awesome! First, we need the secret Monster Math word that will help us get the job done. Ah! Ah! Word Monster! Monster! Today's secret Monster Math word is... Measure! Next time you see Word Monster and hear him squawk, shout out the secret Monster Math Word with us to make something math amazing happen! Measure! <laughs> Not yet, Goo! Wait until you see Word Monster again! Oh, right! Come on, squad! Let's go sort out some scary monster masks! <laughs> You're just in time. The little monsters are starting to get restless. They want to put on their scary masks. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> Not so funny. Scary. <laughs> Silly goo. <laughs> Don't worry, Mrs. Mopley. We'll help you get all these masks straightened out. But how can we find which mask matches which monster? The perfect fit will cover the monster from the top of his head to the tips of his toes. You may need to measure the masks and the monsters. Measure the masks and monsters? How will we do that? Ah! Ah! Did you see word monster? That means we all need to shout the secret monster math word, measure. Are you ready? Let's shout it together on three. One, two, three. Monster Math Monitor. A big, tall monster needs a coat. A little measure monster can help him out. Counting the bars will give his size. Just the right coat will be his prize. One, two, three, four. That's all. That big monster's body is four bars tall. That little coat is two bars tall. A coat that size is way too small. The second coat is four bars tall. That's the very best fit of all. <laughs> that was really helpful. Now we know about measuring. We also know the perfect monster to help us with that. <whistles> measure monster! <laughs> Let's measure the masks and the monsters. Come on, squad, we can do this. Let's, Let's do, do monster math! Hold still, little monster.
monsters. Careful, Goo. <laughs> Silly monsters. All right, little monsters, gather around, please. The Monster Math Squad is going to help us get the masks sorted out by showing us how to measure. Let's get measuring! You hold the measure monster up beside the thing you want to measure, like this. Okay, let's count how many bars tall the mask is. One, two, two three. three! This mask is three colored bars tall. So we need to find a little monster who is also three bars tall. Okay, little monsters, who wants to be measured first? <laughs> Mrs. Mopley said that the masks go from the top of their heads to the tips of their toes. Is that measure monster in the right place? No? Right! He has to hold measure monster at the top of his head. And let it go right down to his toes! Yes! Let's measure together. Count the bars with us. One, two! That little monster is two colored bars tall. The mask we measured is three colored bars tall. That means it's too big for that little monster. This one is smaller. It might fit. One, two! The mask is two colored bars tall. This mask will fit just right. <laughs> We still need to find a monster for this mask. It was three colored bars tall. Let's see if this mask is the right size for you. Come on, squad. Help us measure by counting the bars again. One, two, three. It'll fit that little monster just right. Yeah, <laughs> Good work. Let's measure the other little monsters. Great job, squad! We matched all the masks to the right monsters. We, we did, did the math. math! We did the monster math! <laughs> okay, time to take the scary face picture. Oh my, this just doesn't seem to be working. I can't see all of our scary little faces. Do you think we need to measure them again? Ah! Ah! Did you just see Word Monster? Then let's shout the secret monster math word, measure, together again on three. Ready? One, two, three, measure! Look, a monster math monitor. A cute little monster flower in a flower pot. A little monster who likes to water a lot. Look at the flowers starting to grow. Uh-oh, where'd the little monster go? That little flower grew to be much taller than the little monster who is much smaller. We couldn't see the little monster in the math monitor because the flower grew to be taller than the monster and it blocked the little monster's face. Just like the taller monsters in Mrs. Mopley's class are blocking the smaller monsters. So, we just have to make sure the taller monsters are behind the smaller monsters. How do we sort out the tall from the small? Six monsters hurrying because they're late. Uh-oh, some monsters can't fit under the gate. To go under the gate, you have to be small. A monster can't fit if he's too tall. That's it! We know that the smallest monsters are two colored bars tall. So any monster taller than two colored bars is too tall to stand in the front row for the picture. So does that mean we have to measure them again? No, Max. Goo can show us which little monsters are taller than two colored bars. Yeah, I can show you. <laughs> uh, how can I show you? You can stretch yourself to be an arch that's two colored bars high and let the little monsters run under you. Any little monsters that fit under the arch are short enough to go in the front row. And any little monsters that can't fit under are too tall, so they go in the back row for the picture. Okay, make an arch. Hey, great arch, Goo. Exactly two bars tall. All right, little monsters. Let's see who can run under Goo. 
<laughs> that tickles. Okay, you fit under the arch. You're short enough to go in the front row. Whoa! This one's too tall. Back row for you, little monster. <laughs> this is fun! Whoa! <laughs> All right, it looks like you two are tall enough to stand in back. I can see all the scary little faces. Everybody give me a great, big, scary monster growl! Yeah! <laughs> that was monsterific! Thank you for helping us. Why don't you come join us for a picture? Oh, boy! A picture? Oh, I love being in pictures! Uh, careful, Goon! <laughs> Everybody say slimy slop. Slimy slop. <laughs> Monster Matherific job, Monster Math Squad. We sorted out the masks and helped them take their scary face picture, and we did it all by knowing how to measure. That deserves a great big monster howl on three. One, two, three. Howl! We, we did, did the math. math. We, we did, did the, the monster, monster math. math. <laughs>